Dominguez Campbell. But along with the outrage of Guantanamo, there remains also the continuing problem of the unequal extradition arrangements between the United Kingdom and the United States. How can the Prime Minister be comfortable with an extradition treaty which results in British citizens having inferior rights to American citizens and a treaty which the United States Senate shows no signs of ratifying? I don't accept that the rights of British citizens are subject to unfairness. I don't accept that. And I'm, I'm very sorry to have to say this to the right on gentlemen and to the Liberal Democrats that I just sometimes wish they would spend a little bit of the amount of effort they do attacking the United States on, on understanding why these issues of international terrorism are so important, why it is important that we actually stand with our allies in defeating this global terrorism. Uh, you can, people can say what they like about it, but I am also entitled to say what I like about this. And I do find the, way, the, the, the uneven way that the Liberal Democrats express themselves on this issue, sorry, all the time, I actually find that an affront given what people are facing right round the world in the face of a global terrorism that I would have thought we could unite and defeat. Yeah.